Welcome to another episode of Shea Moisture Virtual Series. My name is Aisha Luby. I'm a hairstylist, educator, and the owner of Crown of Glory Natural Hair Studio. And today, we're gonna to be talking about length retention and avoiding breakage. I'm gonna help give you some tips on how to support hair growth for all hair types. Length retention is a hot topic, as I am often asked, what can I do to get my hair to grow longer? And the answer is simple, hair care. I know, I know, we don't have time to take care of our hair, but I recommend that you set aside some time, you deep condition your hair uh, once a month at least, using your favorite deep conditioning treatment. This will help with moisture and elasticity. Hair that is properly moisturized does not break that easily. I also recommend trimming your hair two to four times a year. Uh, this will help to keep your ends clean and prevent splits from splitting up the hair strand. Keep in mind, the longer you go between your trims, the higher the chances are you're gonna have to cut more hair. So I recommend that you do it every two to three months, be consistent. Do more low manipulation hairstyles such as buns and twists. This helps to tuck away your ends and keep your hair protected from everyday wear and tear caused by styling. Protective styles are also great for giving your hair a break. Sometimes we do a little bit too much and it's nice to just put it away every once in a while. Make sure that it's not too tight. Doing all of these things consistently and with intention will help you minimize breakage and retain your length. So I'm gonna be using Shea Moisture's Hemp Seed Oil Lush Length. It has ginseng, which is good for revitalizing hair and scalp. It also has cannabis, which is packed with vitamin E, which is good for your skin, and horsetail extract, and it helps to encourage growth by stimulating blood circulation. And who doesn't want that? The leave-in conditioner for the hemp seed oil line is really light, creamy, it's nice to use when your hair is wet, and it's also nice to use as a daily spritzer for moisture. It smells really nice. It smells kind of minty a little bit minty, which is also good. Peppermint is really good for um, stimulating the scalp, so if you can find your product like this, I would. The beauty about this product is that it is paraben-free, it's sulfate-free, it's mineral-free, and it's color-safe, and you can use it on pretty much any hair type. Okay, so we're gonna be um, styling my lovely model here, Nikisha's hair, in a protective style. Uh, very simple for uh, feet and cornrows. Her hair is about three, type three, type four mix, and she likes to wear her hair curly. So today we're gonna switch it up and just give her a quick protective style, something that will give her hair a break from the wear and tear of everyday styling. The ends are the oldest parts of your hair. So you wanna make sure that you keep your hair moisturized. And today I'm gonna to be using the Shea Moisture Lush Length Hemp Seed Oil Line. Uh, it has ginseng, it has a little bit of cannabis, which is really, really good for vitamin E content. And vitamin E is also very good for your skin. So it's a plus, plus, plus. All of these products you can find uh, at Walmart, Amazon, and even Shoppers Drug Mart. And if you have a hard time finding the right product for you, you can visit findyourshea.ca to find the right product to use in your hair. So just apply your leave-in conditioner. I usually like to apply my leave-ins to wet hair. Actually, apply all your products to wet hair for extra moisture. Make sure that you start at the roots and then you work your way all the way down to the ends. The ends are the most important part of the hair because they are the oldest and the oils come from the scalp and they take a lot longer to get down to the bottom of these strands. So you wanna make sure that you focus on the ends a little bit longer, apply more product, more moisture, and keep your ends safe and hydrated. All right, so I'm going to Finish applying the leave-in conditioner to her hair. And for a little extra moisture, I'm going to apply some butter. I'm gonna use the Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie, just to give her a little bit more moisture because when you put your hair in a protective style, it tends to dry out. And by the time you take your style out, your hair is dry. So we wanna make sure that we're helping to retain the length and by moisturizing, that'll help to prevent breakage. So the style that I'm doing is uh, called feed-ins. So I'm just going to cornrow her hair gently around the edges. And then I'm going to apply a little bit of this, uh, extensions to help elongate the braid. Uh, extensions are optional, you don't have to use extensions. But it does help to make your look a little bit 
more fancy. And it makes your style last a little bit longer too. So you wanna make sure that your protective styles are comfortable, not too tight, because excessive tightness can actually damage your hair. Excessive pulling. So I'm just gonna finish this braid off. So a style like this can last you about two weeks. It can last you a little bit longer depending on how well you take care of your hair. You wanna make sure that you tie your hair down at night using a satin scarf or a bonnet. Um, but if your hair is a looser curl pattern, you probably can only get away with about a week's worth of style. Uh, but it is still good to put your hair away every once in a while and give your hair a break. Okay, so her style is all done. I'm going to spin her around so you guys can see. Her ends are tucked in, so her hair is protected and this style offers versatility in the fact that she can put it in a ponytail. She can bun her hair on the side into little uh, space buns, or she can wear it down. How do you feel? Feel good? I feel great. The edges are okay? Mm -hmm. Good. Thanks for watching today's episode. My name is Aisha Luby. You can follow me on Instagram at the Aisha Experience. You can also follow my salon at crownandglory.ca on Instagram and on Facebook. Huge thank you to Shea Moisture for having me today. Until next time, thanks for watching.